top level managers around the world. This is your friend Al Mamun, top level expert. I'm from Bangladesh and you're watching Mamun Prefer Gaming. In this video, you are going to watch top level event, which is Penalty Clash, the future superstar event. I'm gonna share five tips on the Penalty Clash event and uh, you will be able to do well if you follow these five tips. Let's watch now what are those tips. After watching those tips, you will also watch how I played this event and how I ranked one in 30 minutes. Tips one, play non-stop 30 minutes. To win this game, to win this event, you've got to play for 30 minutes non-stop. And uh, for the three stage, you will have three chances. And in those three chances, you will have to play 30 minutes for each chances non-stop. So if you play non-stop, you can win. Only you can win a little bit. You can be top in your group when you have non-stop playing habit. So once you start and uh, start playing and keep playing until the 30 minute finished and uh, doesn't matter whether you win or lose, try to score and try to play till 30 minutes. I'm sure that you will be in uh, one to three place. You will be first if you can manage to win most of the matches. Let's say you played three matches and you tried to win two matches. You played four matches. You tried to win two matches. So in that sort of cases you will uh, win definitely you will be one two uh, three position you must have patience so be patient to win this make the ball unstoppable that's the thing you gotta do make the ball unstoppable this is the tips number two keep the ball on the bar and uh, the way you will keep on the bar so that it comes in the goal so the timing must be very good. This one is very difficult. You know, you will not be able to do it always. Try your best to do this. Even myself, I make mistake on it. Tips three, keep your timing right. You will have to keep your timing right. Uh, on the green, you'll have to uh, tap and you'll have to leave the button when it is on the green. Otherwise, it will happen like this, just you have seen. So it will go up and uh, you will not be able to keep on target. So this happens, you know, like this one, as you can see, I have timed it very well. So you got to have mind uh, aside of that so when you will have to hold, uh, tap the button and hold and when you will have to leave the button. So leave the button when it is the green very quickly, you will have to do it. Otherwise, as you can see, another time, second time. So if you are not that quick, then you are in trouble in this event. Uh, th then this event is not for you. So as you can see, consecutive time, you know, consecutively I have clicked on the green. If you click on the blue, then what happens? Then it may have chance to go, you know, very up. Sometimes it will uh, stay in the goal, sometimes it will not. Sometimes it will go so up. So sometimes it will uh, will not be on the target. So you'll have to keep in mind and you'll have to keep the ball always uh, on the green. Do not keep on the blue. So as you can see here it is lucky and the ball is in the goal but sometimes it won't stay in the goal. It is gonna be out of target. So uh, this is the way you will have to play. Tips number four, focus on your opponent's shot. You will have to focus on your opponent's shot always, so whether your opponent is uh, shooting on the right side most of the time, shooting on the left side most of the time, shooting upper, shooting in the middle. So you will have to understand this. Once you uh, look at your opponent one, two shot, you will understand. Sometime you, you will understand his psychology where he can exactly, you know, shoot. In some point, sometimes you will understand that your opponent is going to shoot in, in that side or, or right side or left side or in the middle. You will understand your own. Uh, this is predictable. Sometimes predictable, your opponent's attitude is like this. Sometimes your opponent can, uh, you know, shot on the right side and then he will try different thing. You know, most of the, you know, most of the penalty takers, they try to take second shot in a different place 
So in that case, you will not uh, show, uh, take, uh, I mean, dive on the similar site. This time you will try also different and that can actually match as well. So sometimes your opponent can be like this. I mean, he will uh, click or he will take shot in the same site, uh, maybe one or two time or three time. It also happen. So you will have to understand, uh, understand after reading the psychology of your opponent. So this is pretty important to understand your opponent's psychology. So when you play quickly, you will have to understand this watching the game. What and uh, after taking few shots, one or two shots, you will have to understand very well. So if it is possible, if it is possible, then the match will go on your favor and also match can turn around as well if you receive one or two goal you can still come back it happens and it's happened many times as you can see uh, you see two misses in this in this match uh, you see two misses uh, from both the sides now i'm taking now i'm taking trying to uh, keep the nerve but i had a bit uh, problem in the internet as you can see and i've lost three chances and uh, it's uh, three and uh, both the opponent is uh, nil I had internet problem but he didn't have internet problem I tried to save his shot you know uh, I almost read his psychology when he took shot so but the problem is my um, internet wasn't really good once you are late once you are late then uh, your shot can be taken automatically and it happens many time an error can happen and they will show you error message and uh, the goal will be uh, out of target automatically so this happened uh, for this opponent as well maybe or maybe he was on target wasn't on target so now as you can see i'm slowly but gradually taking the nerves i am holding my nerves and uh, trying to come back in the game as you can see there is some error issues as well it can happen in your game as well so you gotta be in mind that it can happen and it is the part of your game and you can be you know frustrated because of this error as well tips number five update the stadium level quickly as soon as possible and you will have to understand the role of the stadium in this event there will be few stadiums uh, phase wise you can say first phase second phase so if you play uh, if you play most of the paces uh, the top paces will be very good for you you will have more point to secure so if you play in the tougher phase then you will get more points than any other uh, opponents as well so play in the difficult phase and uh, go up quickly that will enhance your point very quickly so keep that in your mind as well and always try to look at your leaderboard as well and do not waste uh, too much uh, spending on time on the leaderboard or now you gotta watch my gameplay how i played and how i played till 30 minutes and secured my place in the leaderboard number one
Thank you guys for watching my video. I am really, really happy that you guys are watching my video and also subscribing my channel. So please do not forget to click the bell icon so that you do not miss any of my updates and uploads.